Hi guys, JJ here, back with another episode on the MEP server, and yeah, this is just basically improvisation. Um, I wasn't expecting to start an episode now whilst uh, strip mining, but I found this cave had a load of zombies, thought it was a spawner, turns out to be a spider spawner, which is kind of weird. So let's see what we got. Ooh, name tag, yes. Brilliant, love name tags. Some iron, I'll take that. Um, the rest we won't be needing, let's see what we got here. Ooh, two golden apples, wow. Um, some more iron, iron horse armor. Take that instead of that. That, well, I suppose. Oh, is, is that a bit? No, it's not too much string. Um, is there a bucket in there? There is a bucket, so let's just take that as well. I don't care if it goes. I don't really care much about the spawner, but I do want to get the mossy cobble. Uh, no. Yeah. Okay, so let's quickly get all of this, and I will see you guys in a second where we're probably doing something else, because I don't want to make this a caving episode, but I will be doing quite a few of them in the near future when I've mined out all of the perimeter, because of course we'll need to go caving as well um, to light up all of the caves underneath the um, perimeter. So yeah guys, I will see you in a second. Bye! Okay guys, I am back. Uh, let's take a quick sleep here. And then we can get fortuning the ores that we got. Um, I did go a bit further with the strip mine after I just recorded that latest bit. And also guys, uh, Shuffle came past. He got the Protection 4 book. So I now have some more diamonds in here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. He also bought an uh, Unbreaking 3 book. And I believe... Wait, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 should be eight. I don't know what happened there. Um, hmm. Slightly confused, but hey. Um, we'll sort that out. I'll, uh, I'll recap. I think I re did I record it? No, I didn't. So, never mind. Um, so, got the ores here that I'm gonna fortune. Let's just put them all on my hotbar, and that will be just perfect. Brilliant. And we can start fortuning them um, one emerald. Oh, shame. Thought I was going to get more, or at least I was hoping to get more. Um, let's just put these back on my bar like so. That'll be fine. Um, and the lapis, and then I'm going to do the redstone and coal off camera quickly, because it takes quite a while. 58 lapis. And uh, yeah, I'm going to get making, I think just make a cube, which is what I normally do. Uh, just kind of, yeah, a shape. So I'm going to make this 6x6, six six, actually, am I? I am, because stuff it. Um, 4, 5, 6. I'm just going to try and make this 6x6 six six and probably include some bread, uh, some coal as well. Let's just get rid of these, actually. Probably not going to be 6 tall at all. Uh, so yeah, I'm going to get working on this guys, and I will be back in one second. See you then. Bye. Okay guys, I am back, and we're going to start mining all of these ores. It's hopefully we're going to get quite a lot, and I hope to just gather so much coal that I don't know what to do with it, and then I can maybe sell it or something, I don't know. I think Chris has got coal for sale as well in his shop because I now have, after this I'll probably have about three, maybe even four stacks of blocks, uh, which is quite a lot of coal. And redstone, my redstone um, um, stocks are flying through the roof as well. I got like, well, flying through the roof. I've got three and a half stacks of blocks, which is also a decent amount. Uh, I remember having more in other places, um, I mean, other servers I've been on stuff and single player worlds, but still quite a lot, and I'm going to try and get a load of diamonds, that's also one the main reason that I'm strip mining, diamonds and also iron, because I'm so low on iron, it's just crazy. Um, I've now got about 14 <laughs> iron or something, and um, well, I had 7, then I found 7 in that dungeon, and now I've got the uh, iron from the uh, from the strip mining as well, so hopefully we'll have quite a lot more iron. I think it's something like a stack and a half now, or over a stack and a half, which is pretty sweet. I do love me some iron, and it's it's probably one of the things I use the most uh, after wood, 
because, well, I suppose wood, cobble, dirt, and iron are like the main things I use. I use quite a lot of diamonds as well, actually. But yeah, I'm gonna make. Where did. Oh, never mind. Okay, now I get it. Um, <laughs> oops. Let's just quickly place that back. Um, there. Uh, that was an accident. Didn't mean to do that. I'm going to have to go down um, underneath the the um, the inner pearl ele elevator as well because I think that some coal will fall down there. And of course I don't want to waste any because coal is very precious. love coal. Um, so I'm going to make a quick cut guys. Get this and put it on a chest and I'll see you guys in a second. Bye. Okay guys, I am back. This is what I got. One less redstone dust than the coal. So 46 blocks of coal, nearly 46 of redstone and 6 of lapis and 1 emerald. So let's shove this in here. Um, not all gone brilliantly. And I've also got some excess here that I can turn to blocks. And this, 54. Yeah, there we go. Um, we can also get the gold out of here and the iron out of these two and actually fill these back up with coal because hey why not uh, might as well just try and keep it stacked up with coal five yeah there we go and what do we want to do now turn the ooh, one there and one there, okay. Let's just quickly turn this all into blocks. And then we can make a cut and go and do something else. I think we're going to pop over to the ender ender and repair some tools, which we need to do because, uh, my, as you can see, well, as you can't see actually, um, I don't have my pick in my inventory. I've got my silk touch one at the moment. Oh no, um, need to repair that and the shovel as well, might as well. So guys, I am going to head over, this is pretty sweet, you can sort these around. Um, pretty sweet, we've got quite a lot of stuff, so actually I think I'm going to put these in here, because hell, why not? Um, yeah, let's just shove them, or actually, no, let's just keep them there. So yeah guys, I'm going to head over to the Ender Ender, and I will see you in a second. Bye! There is my pick. Brilliant. To repair that. Uh, let's put the silk touch away. And how many do we need for the shovel? Can't exactly remember. And also, guys, uh, 33 as well. Um, also, guys, I've just remembered that I'm still wearing my Christmas skin, so I should probably change that back. Um, I'm going to make a quick cut, get up to level 33, which will not take long at all using this lovely ender ender and also guys I am going to what am I going to do? I'm going to change my skin god um, <laughs> just losing track of thought so much uh, the last three episodes I'm really crap at the moment rather rusty on the recording part of this so guys I'm going to see you in a second bye okay guys I'm back and I've repaired my shovel and I got my skin back hell yeah Thank you very much, Chris, for the Christmas skin. It was pretty damn awesome, but I I just love my skin. My skin is pretty damn awesome, I think. I just, I don't know. I just like the, the different gradients of colors. It just looks so cool. It was literally just mucking around in paint until I found the right colors. But yeah, I wasn't going to tell you guys that. It was a complete secret. No one else knows. Um, so yeah, I was just looking on I buy power.com is that what it's called a uh, computer site I don't know if you guys know it you might do and if you do well it's awesome and um, I was looking at a custom built computer that I, I built myself kind of thing and basically what I looked at was yeah just everything like the best stuff there is and it cost like three thousand seven hundred and fifty dollars or something it looked awesome though it just did look awesome um, with like uh, i7 for 930k um, and then like a tight GTX Titan 6 gigabytes um, that kind of awesome stuff um, I wonder if Evil Savage is ever going to finish this completely 
Or I, I did try at one point to finish it, but it failed miserably and I got knocked off as soon as I got up this ladder. It was an enderman waiting on the top when I tried to hit him. I didn't take up all my armor and stuff. So, yeah, that was lucky, but <laughs> basically I took everything off. Just took, like, a stack of pistons and four stacks of another break or something, and I died. So, yeah, it, it was brilliant, basically. <laughs> Uh, so guys, I'm going to head back to my house, and we're going to do something interesting, so I'll see you in a second, guys. Bye! Okay, guys, I am back, and yeah, I actually hate snow. I just hate snow. Um, this portal is not staying here for sure. Definitely going to change it. It's going to probably be about here-ish. Something like that. Um, yeah, probably. And then I want to build a kind of house here. I don't know what it's going to look like. And this looks pretty terrible, so I want to kind of fill that in as well. Let's get some dirt and do a bit more terraforming on top here. Uh, because it's definitely not... I'm just going to carry on changing things until I leave this server. Which I probably won't do anyway. Until like, well... I don't know. I can't look into the future, so I don't know when I might stop changing this. But it's going to be a continuous project and I really want to start doing a lot more building on the server now because it's probably my weakest point building personally I don't think I'm brilliant at it I don't know some things look good like this I, I really like how I made this house it just it looks good for me at least but in my opinion it looks good um, yeah I, I don't know do you guys like it I I really like it. I, I, I just love this design of the walls. I'm really happy I came up with it. Um, let's see. Do we want to go down? No, we don't. We don't want to go down. What am I talking about? Jeez. Um, so, yeah. Does that look a bit better there? That looks a bit better. So, yeah. I think I'm going to jump into creative... Wait. Actually, we can jump into creative ourselves. I don't know exactly what I want to make. Um, okay. Downloading terrain. Times at zero. Um, we could get rid of those stairs because I'm definitely not going to do that. And I've made this different, but I sort of want to bring it over to what it was before. Look, it's just it's weird seeing that it used to be like this. It's like I changed my tree farm. I made a tree farm here like so long ago. It's just crazy. I want to see at the end. I'm going to go over to where the perimeter is and take a look at it because it'll just look so weird compared to what it is now. So what's it actually look like from underneath? Did I do any terraforming here? Not really. Um, no, I just put in a whole dirt layer here. That's about it. Um, so, a house. Um, oh, I hate this. Snow. Is there like... Can I... Wait, no, I can't make it not snow, can I? I could, in MC Edit, get rid of all these things, but... Okay, that's just that's just me. Just stop. Okay, so a house. We want something... I don't really want it similar to that. That's a bit too... I don't know. If you look at it, it is a bit tall for the width. Because it, like, at the ends, at the two ends, I mean, like, here and here, it's only, like, five wide... No, seven wide. And at the top, it's of course a lot wider, especially with the the roof. The roof makes it look a lot wider. So, because with the roof added, it's like 11 blocks wide or something, which is quite wide, <laughs> I must tell you. Um, so, this path design, I need to change that. I don't know if I'm even going to have a path. I might not even have a path. It just might be completely random and stuff. And I don't know. I don't know. Something like this, just just change it up a bit. Something like that, and then do we want some stone in there? I don't know. Does stone look good or not? And we want to get this. We don't want to be able to see any dirt. So uh, this looks derpy. That looks so derpy. That looks a bit better. Um, yeah, I suppose. No, we're just not going to do a path. Paths just look weird. We're just going to keep it how it is now. It's fine. Because it also looks a bit derpy here. Okay, we'll just leave the path. Path idea is just not going to happen. So, um, house. I don't know. I think I'm going to make a cut here, guys. I work a bit in this world. Try and plan some stuff out. Do you know what? 
I loaded this world in 1.6, or at least where I wanted to be, for the MEP remake map, and then, of course, this bit over here loads in 1.7. We got, ah, uh, we got a witch hut. We've got a um a thick, what's it called, a roof forest. We've got a savanna. It's like, come on, give me a break. It's uh just so annoying. Okay, my FPS is dropping quite a bit now. Um, yeah, horses, it's like, uh, annoying. Yeah, I'm gonna fly back the other way, because we're loading, we're loading the world, and it's lagging me like hell. Stop lagging, please, maybe. Okay, that's better. Looks better. Yeah, we're up to 60 FPS. Okay, much better. So, guys, I'm gonna make a cut, work out some stuff in this world, and I will see you guys in a second. Bye! Okay, guys, I'm back, and I have what I think is a pretty cool idea. Are there sheep over there? Or are they just they're just not loading in? Okay. I was just wondering. Um what is the loading distance of entities actually? If I do F three now, there are three hundred and eleven entities and there there are okay, so they there are one hundred there are three now in my view and now there are hundred and ninety eight. Okay, so it's just if you can see there in the cows, if you've got it on full screen, it's just loading the cows in as I walk over. Okay, that's interesting. Wonder how far that is. Um Oh yeah, I'm not in creative anymore. <laughs> Oops, forgot about that. Tried to double jump, didn't work. <laughs> okay, so let's jump back up here quickly. I've got an idea, I have not worked out in creative at all. So this is basically fresh for me and you guys. So I've got the idea that we're gonna do this. We're gonna just Yeah, we're going we're just going for it. Um, something like this and we want to go down a layer and then we want to something like yeah I don't know exactly how I want it to look but something like this and then we just move along I'm gonna make it three high and then basically try not to break through into the um, the bottom of this um, thing and then we, I want to make it right over to or pretty much or close close to the end of this tunnel kind of thing and then well it's gonna, just gonna look cool um, so I'm gonna get working on this guys and I will see you back in a second bye okay guys behold the mysterious entry to what appears to be a cave and then we find my nether portal hopefully I think it will still link up won't it because it's barely moved that much compared to what it was yeah see should be fine and go back through. Let's just cross our fingers and hope. Yes, brilliant. I I don't want to have any torches in here because I want to have this kind of mysterious feel to it. Like the nether port is the thing that actually lights up kind of thing, which I think is quite cool. Um, you can't. No, you can't. I, th I thought you could mine stuff through it, but that's only when you're inside. Oh, damn. Um. I wanted it to all be stone, so I sort of alter, <laughs> altered, altered it, kind of thing. If you get what I mean. Um, damn. Um, oops. Okay. Uh, let's get another block of stone then. Typical. I had one left, and I thought, well, instead of, I'll just use that. So I, I did use it somewhere, and then um, turns out I do actually need one more block of stone. Damn. Um, no. Why am I trying to put dirt in there? It's like. Pointless, pointless action. Um, okay, we've got 55 obsidian, which is quite uh, an amount. And let's quickly close that. Okay, so if we just put this back, then we can actually go down and and get back the final. The um, what am I trying to say? I'm trying to say we can get the last of our stuff. Ooh, I nearly hit it. Nearly. Close enough. Close, close, close. This one here. Yep. Um, okay, a load of leaves and just general stuff. So close. Okay, we'll just leave the saplings. And inner pearls are here. Okay, I need to try. Yeah, I'm, I'm close. I'm close to being able to do this perfectly, just using three ender pearls from the shore without even having to walk. 
Uh, why am I closing the door on myself? God. Actually, let's close that first because otherwise we're going to have a creeper walking in on us. Like usual. Uh, let's put them here. Oh no, that was not enough space, obviously. There we go. Spruce leaves. Might have more of them coming. And where else do we have stuff? There we go here. Mushrooms. Paper. Put that in. Yeah, let's do that. Let's put that in with the um, other things. Flint, we can now keep somewhere else. Pumpkins don't want in there. Actually, mm. Yeah, let's put them in anyway. Lily pads, put them there. Clay. And this. Okay, guys, I'm going to sort this and I'll be right back. Okay, guys, I am back. And yeah, I've been doing some work at the perimeter. Um, where I last left off, we were up a layer higher trying to get rid of the these kind of blocks. And now I've just mined out this whole thing. And that is why there are a load of blocks here. Uh, actually, let's just pick up this dirt. Nope. Empty inventory. Um, like so. I like to pick up mostly the dirt because I got a lot of cobble already. Um, so, yeah, I've been doing quite a bit of work. I actually broke my pick accidentally, not paying attention at all, and uh, broke it, so I had to make a new one waste of diamonds and no well not diamonds because it was pretty much broken already and it cost three to repair it but just a waste of um books really two efficiency fours and i'm bringing three to get it back so yeah. kind of annoying um so yeah guys i'm gonna make another cut now and i will be back when i probably got rid of this layer here i think yeah so uh, guys i'll see you in a second bye Okay guys, I am back and today we are going to be making a quick system for damn it. Oh I need a I need a um a sticky piston, another sticky piston from a um a oh, what are they called? What slime is drop? Slime balls. So stupid. Uh yeah, but we're gonna make that because quite a few people were asking, JJ, why don't you just make one of those things for mine cards? It's a lot easier. I've got mob drops over here. What am I looking for? God. Totally lost track of everything that I'm doing. Um, that always happens, doesn't it? No, how do you make one? No. That. Brilliant. And now I'm tracking it on the floor. God, doing so well. Um, yeah, so I'm going to make a minecart. It's like a loader system. So basically, well, actually, let me just quickly jump into the creative world that I've got. And I will show you guys. So here it is. Let's just place these back um, and then I can show you exactly how it works if I just put these in here and then that over there put that on there and then these over here and so basically what you do you do that and then wait what huh why you not work why you not work um, and that's suddenly given up on working Okay, this is weird. It suddenly stopped working because it can't be bothered to... What? Why are you suddenly not working? Okay, this is really weird. Why are you suddenly not dispensing them? You're dropping them. Oh. <laughs> It's pointing. It wasn't pointing upwards. Okay, that was actually totally logical. Who cares? No. What the hell? What? Why are you? It was just working, and now it's suddenly not. What is up with this game? What? How can you suddenly start working? Oh, I don't understand this, guys. I'm going to work on this quickly and see exactly what I've done wrong. Is it because... Wait. <sighs> Being stupid. Okay, yeah, so this is what I'm going to build um, in on the MEP server because it's a lot easier just to get around with the minecart and stuff and you don't waste your food going uh, to and fro from my tunnel. So uh, let's jump back into the MEP server and I'm going to quickly make it. Um, 
Okay, uh, have I got everything I need? Double check, double check. Yep, looks like it. I have, yep, got my silk touch. Okay, just for the glass, because I don't know, I might need to remove some glass around it. We will see. Um, okay. So I'm going to make it here. Oh, lag. Okay, something like this. About here. Um... So I want what do I want? I want this. I want wait. Um, no, I need that. Th no. <laughs> Thinking it was creative, trying to break it with my hand. Brilliant, JJ. Um, need that there, that there. Then we want the rails going over that. Then we want to break this rail. Put a redstone block there, like so. And then we want the piston to go here like so and we want the block to go on top of that and then we want the redstone underneath okay okay so let's see this redstone is slightly annoying because it sort of mucks some stuff up um, okay how's it work exactly I can't exactly remember I believe it is wait so it comes out of I'm gonna put the pulse in here and then it should come down wait I don't want to make this too deep um, like so and then it should wait I'm putting the pulse onto there okay so if we do this this and then like so that should be okay and then we need to put a repeater into that block so otherwise it won't power. I believe that should work. Um, let's see, let's just get these on our bar like so. Um, okay, so we want that there, that there. Okay, I need to get out. This is a really helpful thing about ender poles, just for getting out of small tight spaces. Um, if I put that, wait, I don't want to block on there, do I? Is that going to break it? No, okay, I'll give it to me. Good, good. And then we should be able to just go along there. And, of course, it's dispensed a rail. Helpful. Um, no, we don't want all of them in there. Okay. Uh, let's see. Put that on there. Um, what are you doing wrong? Oh, it's actually facing down as well. Jeez, same problem as just then. So, put three of them in there. Put that on there. Okay. Easy enough. And now you've got to come back and we're going to do the other side. Okay, this is not actually too difficult, brilliant. I didn't know what the redstone was. I looked up a tutorial, but I couldn't find one, so I just sort of made it myself. Maybe I should make a tutorial about it. Up to date one would be um, pretty good because uh, it's it's basically what Etho did, except a lot more compact. Um, okay, so here we wait. What? Who did that? Oh, that's the design. Okay, sorry, <laughs> I got slightly confused there. Um, so we're gonna want to do it over here as well. Then a bit further up, or do we? Yeah, um, like so. Okay, let's just get rid of this and then this as well. Oh, that's um, right into there. Brilliant. Okay, no clue how far back I need to go. I can get some stuff off my bar actually. Um, okay, let's just block that off like so and that like so okay this should be good and then we need to make this a bit deeper um, maybe not that deep okay um, so we want the oh what the hell that was spontaneous lag um, okay piston there then we want the um, dispenser there underneath here we want the hopper Okay, and then we want the two rails on top of that. We want the redstone block here, like so. 
and then we want let's see am I doing this yeah I am doing this right also okay and we want that there we want to break these two because they're in the way and we want to get the redstone dust oh my god what is happening okay there it is god's sake lag um, we want this to go like this and then up a block is that going to be right? Um, I'm unsure right let's just put it back one more I feel like that would be a bit more secure um, like so, like so, we haven't got enough redstone, brilliant oh wait yes we have, I've got a whole load of blocks so stupid um, and then like that, that should be good why can I not pick up this block? Oh god. Don't ask. Just don't ask. Um, we don't want that there. Oh, and there the server goes. Can I join back again? Or is it going to punish me? Okay, seems to not be lagging anymore. Brilliant. Um, let's get these two back on my bar. Oh wait, no, we don't want that there. We want that there. And then... Oh no, not that there either. Oh, it's going so well. Let's get up here. No. Nope. Oh god. Where the... Oh, jeez. What am I doing? What am I doing? Who knows, guys. Just don't ask. Um. Okay. That there. That there. That there. And we don't need these. And then we need to put a button there and that should be it oh wait uh, I haven't put any yeah uh, helpful if you have minecarts in it as well okay guys this should be it wait did that dispense too I don't know just quickly turn that down for the second whilst we're riding in it okay so that's that done pretty much and I think I'm going to end the episode here might as well been going on a while and I think it's about 30 minutes should be good if not I will check the recordings and you'll probably see me back um, it still carries on going through which is kind of annoying um, oh damn it god damn it okay so what's going to happen here is I'm going to go up against here and it's meant to stop oh wait of course it won't stop because it's all powered isn't it Ah, that's a slight problem. Um, okay, stuff it. We'll just put them back in manually, kind of thing. Or just throw them onto here. Mm, is that going to work or not? No, it just bounces up and down. Um, hmm. Ah, and of course, that's powered, so that's never going to move anything. No, oh, damn it. Um, okay, this has a slight flaw in my plan. Um, hmm. So when we click that, it needs to power these as well. Oh, jeez. Um. Okay, guys, I'm going to go and work that out in survival. And I will be right back. Yeah, okay, guys, see you in a sec. Bye. Okay, guys, I'm back, and I have... Basically, I've moved this thing... Um, forward is it? Forward one block, I believe. Yeah, forward. Okay, so let's just fill this in quickly, uh, like so. And then this is grass. And so basically, it works absolutely fine now. Uh, can this be filled with thingy? Not. Um, wait, we could. We can do that, can't we? Yeah, that'll work. Should do at least. Okay, and this should look absolutely perfect from the outside. And if we put some mine cards in, it should look even better. Um, let's see. Okay, there we go. Looks a lot better. Uh, so you just click the button, get in. And I don't think. Wait, have I modified this side completely? No, I haven't. So this is still not perfect because it's. It, oh wait, I just broke that. Oops. 
Um, so basically you break the minecart and it falls in. It hasn't got the redstone here anymore. It's got it so that it powers this block, which then... So basically, if I... Um, so if I come back and my minecart... Okay, so I, I'm, coming, I'm coming back and then my minecart gets loaded into there and it goes into there and then it goes into there which is brilliant and then just do that and you get back in perfect so I'm gonna quickly build that on MEP because I've got to move absolutely everything so I'll see you guys in a second when I have done that bye okay guys so I'm back and I've got it fully working here we go and as you can see it's turned back off again it's just brilliant I love how this works okay so I'm gonna make a quick cut get over to the other side and I'll show you there too bye okay guys here we are so if we get off there and then we break the mine car it goes in just perfect replace this glass that I accidentally broke with this pick instead of my silk touch and that's it and that's also gonna be it for this episode guys so thank you for watching and I'll see you next time bye